I met you last year. year. Oh, yeah. Sundance. Yeah, it's cute. Cute. But you're like a Sundance veteran. It's kind of cool that you that. are all I am so excited to even think. I still think I've been invited to the Cool Kids Party. That's a great festival. way to describe it's it, actually. so awesome here. <laughs> I love it so much. So tell us a little bit about this film and what drew you to it. Oh, I mean, I, this... Uh, gosh, I think this, this movie is so beautiful to me. It's... it's it's about a, a family that's kind of living, I would say, a little bit off the grid, and a, tra a tragedy kind of forces them to kind of have to like open up their bubble and let the world in. And how, how hard, hard that is. It's kind of like a metaphor. I'm a mommy. I think it, to me, it's like a. It feels like that metaphor of having to like let your kids go. It's hard. It sounds emotional. Oh. <laughs> yeah, and also very funny, and Steve Zahn is incredible, and I, I mean, I think it's all going to be about, I mean, Viggo Mortensen is just extraordinary. So when you read the description of the film, it sounds very serious. There are funny moments to it, and lighthearted moments too. Yes, I think so. I hope so. Yes, I hope so. I, I think they're absolutely uh, will be. And Matt Ross is such a, an extraordinary, extraordinary director. I, I cannot wait to get in, hopefully get in there with him again someday. Awesome. Now, do you play Vigo's wife, or can you say? No, I play his sister. His sister, okay. Yeah. So what was he My like? husband would be terrified. He would be? If I had played Vigo. <laughs> he would not have liked that very much? I would have loved it. <laughs> But him not so much. <laughs> no, <I'm kidding. laughs> no, thank you. Oh, thank you. Thank you so, so nice much. To see you again. Take care. Good to see you again.